President Donald Trump's cancellation of a planned visit to the UK next month to open the new US Embassy ISNT breaking too many hearts on British Twitter. See related US Embassy features London's first new moat since medieval Arrain fact. Many of Trump's UK detractors, including Labour MP David Lammy, rejoiced to learn that the controversial commander-in-chief would no longer be on ribbon-cutting duty in London next month. Happy Friday everyone https colon slash slash t dot co slash dbfc 7 n one him David Lammy at David Lammy January 12th 2018 Trump cancels trip to the other UK pick dot twitter dot com slash j w one x six cook three Jason Mantle at j 50 and 85 January 12th 2018 no worries mate let's reschedule for when you're less racist Graham Puttick Graham Puttick January 12th 2018 although those who had been eagerly anticipating the planned mass demonstrations outside the new embassy were a tad disappointed. Imsad Trump cancelled his trip to London. He denied Britons the opportunity to all come together against him. Sunny Hundle at Sunny underscore Hundle January 12, 2018 for sale. Four X demonstration placards. Unused. Would suit anyone opposing racism at the colour orange. May include expletives. Collection only London. Henry Warren at Henry Warren January 12, 2018 Other tweeters helpfully suggested other destinations for the president not to visit. Please don't come to Ireland either. Yours sincerely. Ireland Bob. B at Irish I January 12, 2018 Please don don't percent you 20190 Let Trump visit Australia either Kim Glasgow at Urban Food Farmer January 12, 2018 And one user had an idea for an alternative trip. No doubt HES going to go on a goodwill tour of Africa and Haiti instead. J. Calvit. Oddball Woof Woof January 11, 2018 Trump's stated reason for the cancellation was his dissatisfaction with Barack Obama's sale of the former embassy site deal which, as many commenters pointed out, was actually struck in 2008 during the Bush administration. Reason I cancelled my trip to London is that I am not a big fan of the Obama administration having sold perhaps the best located and finest embassy in London for percent U. 201 C P nuts percent U 201 D only to build a new one in an off location for 1.2 billion dollars. Bad deal. Wanted me to cut ribbon? No. Donald J Trump at Real. Donald Trump January 12, 2018. The logic struck many as thoroughly unconvincing. Pick dot twitter dot com slash ampuizzle. Paul at Bing Goings 14 January 12, 2018. Prompting Twitter users to share their own tongue in cheek excuses for giving their own planned excursions a miss. I cancelled my trip to London because I'm told snails do not wear hats there. This is a valid and understandable reason. Joe Thornley at Joe Thornley January 12, 2018 I cancelled my trip to Monaco because I am not a big fan of Formula One running the Friday practice sessions on a Thursday. They begged me to come and race still, as they have heard how good I'm at F1 2016 on Steam and they knew I would win. No, board Flankrest at board Flankrest January 12, 2018 Yep. And when I was 16 I cancelled my trip to Jessica Alba percent you 2019's house because I didn percent you 20190 like percent you 2018 and to the blue percent you 2019. HTTPS colon slash slash t dot co slash ukalunli vp Sam Lesser at Sam Lesser 89 January 12th 2018 The reason I cancelled my trip to Tesco was because I WASN percent you 2019 a fan of the moving the washing up liquid a bit further down the aisle. They also wanted me to walk further to the oranges. No, Rachel at Cookie 2407 January 12, 2018 The new embassy, a high-security fortress in Battersea which cost an estimated $1 billion, will now be opened by U.S. Secretary of State Rex Tillerson.